Rack at the game too. Um, I'm pretty sure he is ranked in, in BC. Uh, the Canadian versus Quinn. SoCal versus BC. Yeah. Let's get into this. This is round four pools coming out of winner's side. Let's see who comes out. Zarengo, a really, really good Falcon. And I'm guessing there's a lot of SoCal Falcons. So this is not yeah. a matchup. We've also no been visited by some of the best Falcons in the world. Between Sean. Andrick and Sean. So, you know, Quinn. Cracked. I no, played one is. time and I didn't take a stock. I'd like, like, <laughs> like, 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 I felt like a, like a helpless taller against him. Like, like Andrick's cracked. Yeah. You know, but we also have Zarengo right here. Um, and one thing that, and one thing that really kind of like waylays Palutena in this matchup is that you can't really take full advantage of Falcon off stage. This Falcon's reversal potential is so crazy threatening. If you're not sure about where your edge guards are, you're gonna be on the business end of Falcon dive in a tech test situation. There's just so much potential that Falcon has because, like, really, this is like probably one of the best like like games that Falcon has been in, you know? Falcon has a lot of potential just to get knee, just to get um, Falcon dive, just to get all of his moves. I mean, even jab there, like, like that is technically a kill move at higher percentage. Like, he has a lot of potential of, of, of killing and a lot of potential to kill early. And that is is really tough right now. But as we see right now, it's supposed to flame trying to do a little bit of damage for Quinn right there. Oh. That Nair almost killing right there, but Paul Lutena We've seen so on. much repositioning and do -si -do and dance and go around between these two in terms of the ledge situation and trying to be on top of the scramble. And Zarango just struck with the iron top. Quinn thought he had an open landing there to, uh, to go and, and get to stage. And no, sir, that dash attack taking care of Quinn's first stock, calling for the uh, the pillar of pain, it didn't come out, Zarango. No fear. No fear, absolutely, in this captain. Doing a lot, a lot happening right now on the BTS screen. Not really sure what's going on there. <laughs> but we are now seeing an even stock game going into game yeah, one with Quinn that's and Nice uh, clinical drag down there to up tilt from Quinn to get back into this one. We're seeing uh, Zarango getting bossed around here at the final third. Oh, and there we go. That's what I'm talking about, Cal. You have to have confidence. You have to be a quiet killer. And Ted Quinn is on it. What a call out with that 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 fade in. But again, I, I mean, Jesus, what a call out getting that down there. Oh, my goodness. Really, like, like making this close game into one of his. This is his game to lose right here. Getting a, a lot right there. Trying to. I'm not really sure what the air dodge is for. I mean, really, really tired, <laughs> hey, sometimes when you're in the heat of the moment, oh, he t he almost got a footstool up that uh, Falcon dive tech. Gotta be careful when you're Zarango, just in the height difference. Getting grabbed, the air dodge to stage that was ballsy. Managed to get behind Quinn, but of course you never want to be with your, you never want to meet Palutena in an alley with her back to the ledge unless you're Zarango because he followed through with that big Falcon kick. And that Falcon kick, it does damage and taking that stock right there. But again, if you are literally so far down in the molehill, like, damn, how do you dig yourself out of there? That anthill is, is a lot. I mean, I'm oh, Queen here we go, Zarango. Right trying to take Quinn on a on a journey. No, don't come back from And Oh, unfortunately, for a second there, Zarango thought he had the distance to avoid the explosive flame. But Quinn, he knew he knew how, how to turn that oven, turn the heat up to the right setting and cooked Zarengo's last stop. That was one of those moments where it's like, oh my god, a, a bake is on this oven and it's way too high. I need to turn it off and it explodes. Whoops, it was a gas leak. And just like that, they're going into <laughs> Gas the game. explosion. Oh, whatever. I mean, literally, it was a close game until Quinn called out that drift in and then got, and getting it down there, shifted the whole set into heat. It changed the whole story. It's a whole story. But wow. I mean, this is uh, Zarengo's played well enough that, that we can get ourselves a game three. Quinn's not careful, especially if he made certain mistakes, disadvantage, and, and Zarengo keys in on it. And then Quinn almost hit him with the uh, honesty special with those nares, not doing much there, getting that throw to get off the stage. Ooh. Hey, hey, Palutena shopped at the grocery store just like all of us. The one hundred percent, and I guess like like I don't know. I feel like Palutena is one of those ones where he is like. 87 coupons and only pays two dollars for 60 items. I mean, to be fair, Rafi Bear said that Zarengo just hasn't quite made as much of his chances with Quinn at disadvantage. Because if we had Zarengo won the opening salvo and started to put the boots to Quinn with those up airs, and ever since then, been kind of quiet. Zarengo right now trying to do it here for Canada. Instead, Quinn trying to send a back. Packing it across the border with that up air. What a really good down tilt in the up air right there. Like, like really calling out the DI on that. Oh, no. The honesty special is going on straight there. He, he, wrapped up, he wrapped up an entire flight's worth of frequent flyer miles on Palisade Airlines. 
Yeah, absolutely no lies on that invulnerable shield or any of those <laughs> nares. My goodness, grabbing 70% damage ah, just I, like that. But again, now we're trying to see if he can get, oh, drag down there into down throw. Just enough, it, just enough indecision right there to get the grab and sneak it in that situation. Too, yeah, no, Cal. very, very honest. I really like Right. I was up with the honesty stuff. Cause, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> one of those jokes I can only like like do like for so long. Uh, oh. That Falcon kick. Wow. Clutch there, there's very few more. options there as honest as, Fal as Falcon uh, kick right there. Man to push Quinn off the ledge, but Quinn able to get some ground beneath his feet and forcing Zoreno into such a tough call here. That snowball is going straight down the mountain right now, trying to get that jab Woo! scenario right there, getting that bear. Ah, and bear, yeah, he jumped just, there. Yeah, just too much distance there for Quinn to survive, nevertheless. Immediately pressing Zoreno as soon as he's back onto the stage, and Zoreno's having a hard time escaping Quinn's clutches. He is putting the boots to him right now. Callie's yeah. going out deep, looking for the final strike. Not quite. Not quite right there, but again, putting that fist straight in her gut. <laughs> uh, hey, why not? You have a stop to lead. Just go for the, the counter that arbitrarily only puts a hitbox in front and behind you. Exactly. Just do it. Why not? Um, I No knee so far. Azringo has to throw it out one time, but again, um, we need to I always have to be careful because I think one of these scramble situations, Quid's going to go for that big killer up smash. Really good call out with that near yeah. killing off the. But again, we are in a scenario again where Drago has a large hill to climb up right now at this moment. Um, let's see what he can do. I mean, uh, but again, the honesty special is, is it's really working out so much. I love it's that. It's a fan there. favorite. <laughs> um, Palti is um, my signature for a reason, and it's because it's so. Still, Drago's so doing honest. a good job of avoiding Quinn when he's trying to put his hands on him, just taking those nares. And after a while, the nares lose really their big primary effect to put the opponent into a good spot for Quinn to capitalize. And Quinn's whiffing right now. He's got to be careful about overextending. Gets the back there though, catching Zerango peeking. You can't open up your Christmas gifts before Christmas, Cal. That's what Zerango's trying to do. Not. It, absolutely not. It, 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 it's, it's, it's not the seventh day yet. You just can't get there. Oh, well, that up top, that F tool was actually the right option there, but Quinn was just a little slow. Getting the grab, force him off stage. You're okay with that grab if you're Zerango, because it's not, you're not in danger of being back thrown to the blast zone. Trying to get that jab off. Oh, deck. is that going to do it? And yeah. that was such a surprising. We're talking about present. Quinn gifted him the most unexpected explosive flame of all. <laughs> like, like, they 